How can I be a blessing to others right where I'm at? Listen to what it says in Ephesians 4. He who has been stealing must steal no longer, but must work, doing something useful with his own hands, that he may have something to share with those in need. See, this week we've talked about how God can use you where you're at to share Jesus and to support those who share Jesus as their full-time vocation. But, you know, it's not less than to take the money you earn as a, as a worker and use that to bless others, to, to feed others, say, your family. It is not wrong or less than to serve as a stay-at-home mom and serve your family, to encourage them and love them, to help your kids with math homework. It is not less than to go and help someone and say, you know what, you don't have enough money to join the team, let me help you, come join. Those two are ways to bless, to use your vocation to bless others around you just in worldly ways. That is not less than. And don't consider yourself less than if you do that. It is a good way to serve others right where you're at. So your vocation, whatever it is, parent, child, employee, employer, volunteer, teammate, friend, all of these are ways that God uses you to bless others through you. And maybe that's the coolest thing about vocation is that you get to stand in for God. God uses you to bless others. And God uses that then to draw others to himself. So yes, serve God right where you're at.